On the occasion of Shiv Jayanti, the Pune office of India Post has released 15 picture postcards themed jewels of Junnar at Shiv Neri Fort. Pune Postmaster General G. Madhumita presented special postcards to the Deputy Chief Minister of Maharashtra Shri Ajit Tawar. Shiv Suman is a critically endangered endemic species with beautiful and distinctive flowers found in the western ghats of Maharashtra, especially on steep mountain slopes and ridges. It is especially visible on the Shivneri Fort in Junna. Conservation of this plant and its habitat is the real need of the hour. Jeevadhan Fort or the Vandarlingi Pinnacle To the west of Junna, the hill fort of Jeevadhan is the crown jewel of Nanighat mountain range. There is a sculpture of Gajlakshmi and a temple of goddess Jeevai in the fort. From the fort, one can see the vast region of Kukan and the beautiful view of Vandarlingi Pinnacle and Nanighat. This fort and the pinnacle are important geological heritage of Junna. Shivneri is an ancient fort in the valley of Shivnar or Kukarnair. This fort is the birthplace of the great Maratha king Chhatrapati Sri Shivaji Maharaj. Junnar village is at the foothill of Shivneri. Shivneri has temple of goddess Shivai, Ganga Jamna water reservoirs, Shiv Kunj, building where Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj was born. Durgawari Sacred Grove is a dense semi-evergreen sacred grove spread at the foot of a small watchtower pinnacle or fort. Many medicinal, rare and endemic plants are found here. The village deity, Vandevi Durga Temple is situated at the center of the sacred grove surrounded by Dhakuba Fort, Kokan Cliff and a huge igneous basaltic rocky plateau. Kukdeshwar Shivale is one of the oldest stone temples in Maharashtra. The temple has intricate stone carvings and masterpieces of architecture that are generally unknown. The river Kukri originates from this temple complex. This temple was built of the Shilahar dynasty King Zans in the 9th century by stacking stones one on top of the other without using mortar. Gulanjwari ancient natural rock bridge is the only known igneous basalt rock geoheritage of this type. This rock bridge was discovered by geologist Dr. Lalit Shirsagar. Nearby there is Gulanchwari in Anighat near Anifata. This natural rock bridge is at 21 meter long and 9 meter wide. Giant meter wave radio telescope at Khodad is one of Junna's most important scientific installations of 30 antennas. It has made a significant contribution towards India's progress in astronomy. Khodad radio telescope installation was led by the late scientist Dr. Govind Swaru. Lenyadri Ganesh Temple is one of the Ashtavinayak Temple. There are 28 caves on the east and west sides of the temple. This temple is in cave number 7. It has a stone idol of Lord Ganesh. The Ganesh is also known as Girijatman. The Ganesh Leni group has two chatagrahas, 28 viharas, 15 water tanks and 6 inscriptions. Nilgiri wood pigeon is an endemic pigeon found in the moist deciduous and evergreen forests of the western Ghat. Food of this pigeon is fruits, small snails and other invertebrates. Breeding season is between March and July. India Post has issued a stamp on this bird earlier. The Empire of Satvanas created an excellent pass in the form of Nanighat for transportation of goods. This pass connects Kukan with central India across the Sahyadris. Those days, Excise duty was levied on merchandise transportation through this pass. A pinnacle on the hilltop is called Nanachangatha. Excavated pathway of Nanighat is about 60 meter long and to 25 meter wide. The Bhutling Cave Group is located in the Manmodi Hills of Junna. Cave number 40 is a Bhut Cave Chatagraha. On the Chatyaj, there is a five winged Nagraj and an eagle in human form. The locals consider these sculptures are of bhut or ghost. The stupas beside them are considered as ling, hence the cave is called bhutling. Hatkeshwar natural bridge is on a hill near Godre village. It is also referred as Varhadi hill. The mountain has two pointed pinnacles and a natural bridge connecting them. On the upper plateau, there are two caves, the old Mahadev, the Hatkeshwar temple plus hundreds of Nandi. The Vadaj Dam has been constructed near Vadaj village on the river Meena. This dam provides irrigation for agriculture to a large tract 
near the dam is the temple of Kulaswami Khandiraya, the adored deity of Vadad. The leopard is from the cat family. A leopard rescue center has been set up by the forest department at Manik Doh near Junna. Shekru is known as the state animal of Maharashtra. It can grow up to three feet in length, mainly seen in the evergreen, semi-evergreen forests of Sahyadri. Shekru is an omnivorous animal 